Kari is right now positioned as one of the top three startups in India in the in the food chain uh, space. If you think of, uh, especially in the last uh, one to two years, there has been a significant amount of churn in the food business. Especially QSRs, uh, quick service restaurants are picking up the momentum. And so the internet first uh, chains, which are like a home delivery chains, are also significantly picking up the momentum. And when you really go outside Hyderabad, uh, for example, Bangalore, <coughs> there are umpteen uh, home delivery options for the customers. So in the last, at least if you see uh, 15 months to 24 months, last one to two years, it has been almost like an unprecedented uh, growth in the home delivery options for, uh, in the Indian, for the Indian food. Primarily because so far, uh, if you think of any home delivery options, we have very, very limited choices such as your Domino's or some of the you know, foreign brands. But for home delivery option, it has always been the myth. Um, let's say if you want to order Indian food, uh, there could be multiple choices for us, but those multiple choices are not reliable because primarily they are not so uh, structured in terms of delivery. And they are not also very sophisticated in terms of taking the calls properly and uh, tracking the orders and so on and so forth. So obviously, uh, there has not been a structure in place of in, in, uh, in terms of home delivery for the Indian food. So I think people have realized it is important for us to give a sophisticated home delivery option for Indian consumers, Indian food consumers, providing an Indian food range. So hello, Kari. Uh, being a Hyderabadi company, we are born here, we are brought up here, we are growing so significantly. Last year, 2014 is when we started off operations uh, with just a one garage. I uh, my, myself is Raju Bhopati, CEO of Hello Curry. I, I quit uh, an IT company, very glorious career. I was managing a, a size of about 6,000 people across globe, 18 countries. Uh, I was a global delivery head at uh, CSE, but always uh, there is an entrepreneurial urge. You know, India also has been the hub of uh, entrepreneurs. And there is, there is so much of incredible space for uh, entrepreneurs to play in India. Hence, I returned from US and started off Hello Curry chain in just about 15 months. And we started as a garage um, in Madhapur, very, very small, rustic garage. We started doing experiments. It's a, it's a quite, quite unexpected for me because and I was just jumping from almost a very glorious uh, position to almost like a garage. We started there. It was 2014, um, first two to three months, it was a very slow start for Hello Curry because there is no store, there is no restaurant. People cannot see us. It is only just the branding. We were just very, very, very small. In Hyderabad, nobody knew Hello Curry when we started off. And then interestingly, because of my IT contacts, and then I started sending food to the customers, some of my own known contacts. We started about sending food for five people, eight people, that to my own contacts, and I was pushing them just to taste the food. And uh, I think within one to two months, we, from about five people, um, every day, order five orders every day, to almost coming uh, to about 150, 100 orders in just about three to four months. And uh, once one of my cousins just uh, you know sent a link of Hello Curry in one of his forums in uh, one of the big con companies. That's when Hello Curry has started uh, you know picking up the momentum. It's almost like a blast. We just uh, they, he shared that like you know, in one of the blogs and saying okay Hello Curry I have seen that it's a good packaging. You have uh, single meal options for the customers if you really want to order for one person. Okay, I want to have uh, you know biryani for only for me. I don't want to have uh, either for two people or three people or one and a half because when you order outside, you don't know how much is the quantity exactly. Is it sufficient one person or sufficient for two people? We don't know it exactly. So I think Hello Curry he has seen the tremendous value, and then he posted his interest in his blog, and that's when I think we never turned back. And it was then Microsoft, it was then Amazon, it was then Google, it was then at Deloitte. It just started exploding like anything. Then Hello Curry, within six months, we have witnessed unprecedented growth. Where we started off about you know five orders per day, right now we are almost doing about 800 orders per day in Hyderabad, and almost our circuits are broken now. And we really have to sometimes stop our systems not to take the orders because we have grown such significantly, such mountainous in the last at least uh, 14 months. 
and that started giving a run for all these uh, you know uh, fine dining restaurants because fine dining restaurants were seeing oh boy hello curry is really really growing faster what really made hello curry grow such such unexpectedly in the last 15 months and then a lot of players started home delivery and for a lot of fine dining restaurants understood that okay home delivery is the option because if uh, customers want to come to you know restaurant it takes at least good one one and a half hour time it's a very very time consuming so obviously everybody realized okay because of hello curry i think i am proud to say that the phenomenon in hyderabad has changed quite a, quite drastically and similarly so we have uh, we have started off uh, bangalore operations um, about 2 months ago my passion has been of course we have to really first steadily grow in hyderabad and then uh, think of expansion but however we have taken a different route because we hello curry is now becoming a national phenomenon we are growing across the nation we picked up bangalore because there are at least 15 home delivery players in hyderabad we are the only prominent delivery player but in in bangalore it is not like that there are several